Hey guys, I just wanted to go through a build I've been working on for, I guess about a month now. i uh, been calling it the Adventure 780, just because FPV is an adventure and it's 780 millimeters. So, makes sense, right? <laughs> but, uh, anyway, uh, the frame uh, is not store-bought. Uh, bought these plates off of Hobby King. They're 300 by 100 by 1.5 millimeter. And uh, I just taped them together, made a stencil uh, where I needed to drill the hose and everything. And uh, drilled the hose and cut the sides off, rounded them nice and everything. And uh, mounted the arms. The arms are 16 millimeter round. Uh, they were 330 millimeter long, but I've cut those down a bit. And uh, the uh, the OSD is uh, a Cyclops tornado for right now, but I'm going to be going up to uh, or uh, going to be getting a uh, DJI Mini IOSD just to save a little bit of weight and. It just looks kind of cluttered up there, so. The flight controller is a nozzle light, but it does have the firmware upgrade. So I'll be able to use that mini IOSD. Um, the ESCs are uh, multi star 30 amp, just basic ESCs. Uh, motors are. Uh, Multi-star 42, 25, 16 KV, 16 pole, and the props are 1447s for right now. I think I'm gonna try some 1455s just to see how they do. But uh, yeah, it flies really good the way it is. But uh, I want a little bit more pep, so I'll try some. 1455s and see how they do. Uh, the Free Sky Tyrannus uh, X8R receiver. Here's yeah, the bottom of it. Just put some standoffs there for the back for the legs. And that's the front is just a uh, like a bar mount thing that I'm using for the front legs. Seems to work fine. But it's, uh, it's about 2,000 grams with the battery. The battery is a uh, 5200 milliamp 4 cell. And I get right around 19 20 minutes of flight time. So, you know, it's not too bad. Uh, GoPro is a Silver 3. Uh, I did mount the FPV camera on a servo so I could look down and stuff from, you know, using the radio. And I did make this mount out of some extra plate that I had, carbon fiber plate. Just drilled the hose and put the dampers in there. It's just 250 milliwatt fast shark transmitter and goggles, all that good stuff. But uh, yeah, it flies really good for the size it is. It's actually kind of fast, really. Oh, one more thing I want to touch on. Uh, if you're looking for ESCs, I would recommend uh, Rotor Geek ESCs. Those are the 30 amp. Uh, really awesome ESCs. It really helped a lot. Uh, I might get some for this. I don't know. I might get some 12 amps for this. But uh, yeah, they're, I mean, they're rock solid ESCs. They're awesome. I really highly recommend them if you're looking for some. But uh, that's what I've got on it so far. Uh, 
I've got a flight video of it. So enjoy that and uh, leave any comments or any questions. Make sure you like it and share it. But thanks for watching, guys. Bye for now.
API mode, no GPS lock, global positioning system, GPS lock on.